and I hear crashing. I hear crashing and banging and smashing and he starts screaming like an animal. And I then just moved Amber into the next room and I just kept her there all night. Whitney Heard just exposed for spinning stories worse than Amber. Amber's sister, Whitney has been exposed for being a mastermind behind twisting stories to favor Amber and fans believe she might be a worse manipulator compared to Amber. It was either that night or the next night, I can't remember exactly, but at one point, Johnny picked up a steak knife and he hurled it at his assistant. Um, it missed him, but obviously Nathan got upset and he left and he was upset as well. And a fight broke out between Amber and Johnny that night. Extracts from the UK case between Depp and The Sun have revealed that Whitney played dirty and here's how. Whitney was illegally allowed to watch other witnesses' testimonies, and that way, she was able to mend and modify hers to favor Amber. Additionally, fans believe that the UK justice was riddled with conflicts of interest making it ridiculously easy for Whitney to spin stories. Aside from Amber's relationship with the judge's wife, dinner parties, and professional connections that the judge's family shared with Amber, Whitney relied on her freedom to tell the judge what she wanted him to hear. But while we thought Whitney was done twisting stories to suit Amber's case, she did the exact thing during the U.S. defamation trial. She gave an account of an alleged event of Depp mistreating Amber but an ex-friend, Jennifer Howell called her out for confessing an invalid account. And even when she and Amber ran out of luck by losing the trial. Did you ever see Mr. Depp appear intoxicated? No. Did Ms. Heard ever show you photographs of depicting injuries on her face or body? No. Did Ms. Heard ever tell you that Mr. Depp was abusive towards her? No. Whitney resorted to social media to project that she told nothing but the truth. I will always be proud of you for standing up for yourself, for testifying both here in Virginia and in the UK, and for being the voice of so many who can't speak to the things that happen behind closed doors. We knew that this was going to be an uphill battle and that the cards were stacked against us, but you stood up and spoke out regardless. I am so honored to testify for you, and I would do it a million times over because I know what I saw and because the truth is forever on your side. She wrote, the siblings allegedly face physical and emotional abuse from their father growing up and share a strong bond. When Depp's legal team cross-examined Whitney and asked her if they had ever been hit as children, she admitted that their father would hit both sisters. We would protect each other for sure, she revealed it. Perhaps, Whitney twisted stories because she wanted to protect her beloved sister at all costs, as affirmed by Jennifer Howell who told the court that she loved Whitney Henriquez but believes she is trying to protect her sister. She is doing something very wrong by supporting her allegations of abuse against Johnny Depp. She said, unfortunately, her lies, twists, and turns have been exposed to the court and the entire public. Here's what fans think. A fan wrote, yes, this is true. They were even texting each other in the courtroom changing their stories. And then she did a victory speech on the steps before the end of the trial. I was so shocked at the verdict as it was clear that they were all lying. Another added, solely blaming Amber, I will never understand why everyone doesn't think Amber Heard is the liar and abuser here. It is obvious in every single way. I believe she planned this whole thing, starting with marrying Johnny in the first place. Then, she instigated the fights, she wanted money all along. That'll be all for now. See you next time for more juicy reports.